The Metro Nashville Public School Board approved an operating budget tonight for the upcoming school year. Members want more than $764 million to run the district in 2013 and 2014. The school year, two charter schools could move into new locations. News Channel 5's Chris Cannon is live downtown now with all the details. Chris. And Kristen, Nashville prep students have called TSU's downtown campus home for two years ever since the charter school opened. But tonight, they let school board members know they are ready to move. Kamaya's there. Josh is there. What's happening inside this classroom at TSU's downtown campus is getting attention. Give that to us in a complete sentence, Bernice. Nashville Prep is a charter school where students are outpacing averages across Nashville. As we hold a really high uh, bar for our expectations academically and behavioral for our scholars, and we keep that bar high. But along with all the success here, there's been a lot of uncertainty. And you know that that's And that true. brought out all these red shirts to the Metro Nashville School Board meeting Tuesday night. Parents, students, and teachers all here to see the approval of a lease that will put Nashville Prep in a building of its own. You've been fighting for a long time to get a facility. This night has been a long time coming. We have now approval for a 10-year lease on the McCann facility. The new location in West Nashville is a fixer-upper, and the folks at Nashville Prep, they know that. But it's it's good enough for us. It's We don't need anything fancy. We just need a reliable building. Uh, and a promise from Metro Nashville Public Schools to work with us as a partner. But after two years in downtown Nashville, parents are ready for the move. Picking up your children after it's a busy street and just, you know, making sure you have a parking spot and trying to stay after five o'clock. The news Here we go. Fire it up. was enough fire it up. to make fire these students scream. Something everyone is certain will happen when they make the move to McCann. One, Having more two, freedom for us now and learning more. Three. And the board also approved a lease tonight for Liberty Collegiate Academy to move into the old Jerry Baxter School on Gallatin Road. Now, Metro Council members still need to approve the leases for both of these schools, but if everything goes according to plan, the charter schools will move into their new buildings in August. We are live downtown tonight. Chris Cannon, News Channel 5 HD.